With the Class B Girls Region Tournaments wrapping up, that meant it was time for the boys' teams at the court tonight as the district tournaments kicked off around the area. At the Mana Auditorium, the District 12 tournament tipped off this afternoon, and in the opener, top-seeded and defending district and region champion Bishop Ryan met up with South Prairie. So let's head to the auditorium for this one. The Lions will jump out to a quick lead. It will be Mason Heber getting things going here as he knocks down this three just like that with 6 nothing in favor of Bishop Ryan. The Lions then will work it around down low to Ruben Lorma Just, who hits this turnaround for two more. The Royals trying to stay close here. James Hood with the pull-up jumper. That made it a 13-4 game, but the Lions hitting on all cylinders. Shanaza Udekwe across the lane hits the floater. And then how about here, Ben Bull with a pull-up long two. The Lions go on to win it 66-20. The second game of the day featured the Deluxe Burlington Lakers and the R Redeemers Knights. First quarter, the Lakers Dante Gunville with a pull-up three, and the Deluxe Burlington takes a 5-2 lead. The Knights answer right back here. Zach Hendrickson hitting a three of his own. More our Redeemers as Matt Hendrickson takes the pass from Landon Lang. He knocks down the three. The Lakers' Will Pearson answers back with a three of his own. Delax Burlington reopens up a five-point lead, but the Knights cut into that lead as Lang makes the nice move down low and lays it in. Our Redeemers goes on to win at the final of the read, 70-65. And again, Bishop Ryan knocking off South Prairie, 66-20. Meanwhile, in the evening session, it was seven-seeded Glenburn taking on second-seeded Berthold. We'll pick it up in the third quarter. And Glenburn's Blaine Stevens for three. The Panthers take a 35-29 lead. Off the fake, the Bombers' Tommy Burke with a nice baseline drive. He lays it in. 37-34, Glenburn led it after three. Fourth quarter, the Panthers' Matt Duffner from beyond the arc knocks down a three right here. The Bombers answer back. Burke makes the nice tip away. How about that? And the steal, he lays it in. And that would cut it to two, but the Panthers would not be denied. Jalen Durr from the corner for three. And then it's Blaine Stevens from straightaway for three. Glenburn pulls the upset, winning 60-46. to The final game of the day, MLS taking on Surrey. First quarter, Surrey's Cole Horner on the drive with the high arcing finger roll. Nothing but net on that one. The Mavericks on the break. It's Riley Strand with the lay in. The Mavericks' lead is cut to three. Here come the Mustangs on the break. Cody Fuchs through the defense and a nice scoop shot there. But the Mavericks would pull away. Isaac Unlin with this pull up one hander gets it to go. Later on the break, it's Ryland Feeland over the defense. As he drops it in, MLS goes on to win at the final read 53 to 42. And again, Glenburn over Berthold 60 to 46. Other action around the area, District 11. It was Botna over West of Newburg 69 22. Velva down Drake Adams 63 61. Nedros losing their game to TGU 60 to 53. Elsewhere in District 10 action at Washburn, it was Garrison uh, losing to Underwood. The Comets winning at 61-36. Wilton wing over Center Stanton, 60-31. Elsewhere, District 15 action at White Shield. First round place on White Shield down Alexander, 66-27. It was also partial over North Shore Plaza, 39-34. Newtown over Trinity Christian, 66-40. And Mandarin down Trenton, 72-37. District 16 action at Ray, first round. Kenmer over Burke County, 52-37. Powers Lake, it's Tioga, 60-26. Stanley over Divide County, 57-24. West Region play-in game tonight. Dickinson over St. Mary's, 52-42 on the boys' side. On the girls' side, play-in action in overtime. It was Watford City, Guinea Dickinson, 64-61. And Jamestown over Belcourt, 79-53. State hockey tournament going on in Fargo. Consolation round. Mina High losing their game to Red River, 2-1. South got Mandan in the consolation round, 9-1. Semifinals, Central over Bismarck. Mark 3-2, and it was Davy shutting out Century 4-0. On the girls' side semifinals, Fargo North South wins it 4-1. Bismarck Blizzard over the Davies Eagles 4-2. Consolation round, Dickinson over Mana High 3-1, and Red River got Devils Lake 5-2. NCHD action, UND over Minnesota Duluth 4-1, and it was an NAHL action, the Minotauros downing Aberdeen 3-2.